Hey everybody, so this is going to be my beauty favorites for April 2015. And I'm going to start off with my favorite of the favorites, and that is two lipsticks. I didn't actually intend on getting two. I intended on getting one. I went, I haven't been drugstore shopping for makeup in a long time, and I went with my new baby, and um, I was there looking for other things, but I decided to look for a lipstick, and she was getting a bit fussy, so I narrowed it down to two colors, decided which one I wanted, thought I put back the one I didn't want and bought the one that I did want, and it turns out I didn't. But I actually fell in love with the one I didn't want when I got home, but still wanted the other one, <laughs> so I went back and bought it. I know that's a weird story, but anyways, I ended up with two lipsticks, and I love them both, and they are from L'Oreal, and they're the collection exclusive. They are the nudes, and one is by Julianne, and one is by JLo. So basically there's a bunch of people that have their own like perfect nude lipstick, obviously JLo and Julianne being one of them. The one I liked the most was from JLo. This is the one I thought I was getting. And it is a really gorgeous nude peach color. It's just like my everyday perfect lip color. That's it there. It just looks like, I don't know, to me it just looks like my everyday lips but better. So it's um nude but it's more on the peachy end which flatters my skin tone really well that's what it looks like it's very creamy it's easy to put on it lasts a long time i've been wearing it almost every day so yes it's definitely one of my favorites and the other one i picked up by accident but fell in love with it's the julianne one that's what it looks like there still a nude but definitely more of a pinky nude and it is so gorgeous as well i'll swatch it side by side so there's the julianne and there's the JLo. So I love both for different reasons. Um, very creamy, they just look so natural and I can just wear them with everything. So I'm just really excited about them because even if I put on like next to no makeup, I can put these on and they totally work. So I'm really happy about that. All right, the next thing is a blush. Had it for a long time, but I'm getting back into my like more creamier blushes, I guess because it's spring, I'm not too sure, but this is the Dream Bouncy Blush by Maybelline in the color Fresh Pink. And I just use a stippling brush with it, as you can see, it's kind of a weird consistency. But I don't know, I just like the sheen, it the sheen it leaves on my cheeks along with the color. Um, I just think it looks really pretty and if I want to look extra glowy I'll put on my ever so trusty hard candy highlighter in honeymoon this is a really gorgeous pink it's a pink blush but it's actually more of a highlight so it looks like there it looks just so pretty on your cheeks I have it on right now not over the uh, Maybelline one but I don't know if you can see it but just gorgeous and then the next one I got in my ipsy month my ipsy bag this month it's the nude dude volume 2 mini eyeshadow in flirty and I've been wearing it almost every day since I got it it's one of those colors that can go all over the lid and just be a one color and done kind of thing and it's what I'm wearing right now it's got a purple base and a gold sheen underneath it so it's really really pretty I've been loving that the last makeup item is a new mascara. I got this on recommendation of Samantha Sherman, who I, is one of my favorite beauty gurus, gurus, and I think we have the same eyelashes because anytime she recommends a mascara, I go out and get it and I love it just like she does. This is the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara. Never tried this one by L'Oreal before. Really weird looking wand, very thin but it just works so well. I can just get in there, separate everything. It lengthens really well, it volumes, it doesn't clump. So I'm really happy with it. And then the last product is for the shower. This is the Body Wash by Everyday Shea, moisturizing for all skin types in vanilla mint. It's giant, it comes with a pump. It's all natural, which I love. I got it off of Vitacost.com, which is my favorite website to get um, supplements and bath and body products. I'll leave a link down below. I think there's a 10% off coupon code if you're a new customer, but this stuff is awesome. It's gonna last forever in my shower. It smells good, it, it lathers good, it cleans well, and it's all natural, so I love it. So yeah, those are my favorites for April 2015. I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching, bye.